God speaks to us in one way or the other. Job 33 verse 14 to 15 says, For God speaketh bones, yea twice, yet men perceive it not. And in a dream, in a vision of the night, when deep sleep fall upon men and in slumbering in your bed. Yes, sometimes when God speaks to us in dream, is to give us strict warnings to preserve our soul from the pit and destruction. But because man gets no interpretation, they still walk in and fall into the pit. Genesis chapter 40 verse 8 And they said unto him, We have dreamed a dream, and there is none to interpret it. And Joseph said to them, Do not interpretation belong to God? Yes, interpretation belongs to the Lord. That is why even kings seek for interpretation to their dreams. In Genesis chapter 41, Pharaoh dreamt and called all the magicians and the wise men in Egypt. But there was none that could interpret his dream. Except Joseph, the one that God has given the gift to understand and interpret all kinds of dreams. Today, that God that gave Joseph the gift to interpret dreams is still available in our generation. That God has endowed his servant, senior prophet Jeremiah Omoto Fuin, with a gift to understand all types of dreams and give you that interpretation that will give you peace. Tell senior prophet Jeremiah Omoto Fuin your dreams today and God is going to give you an interpretation that will give you peace through him. Today, aujourd'hui, our sermon is titled intitulé, Dream and rêve. Interpretation. Put your hands together for Jesus. Dream. Les rêves. Dreams are messages that Les God messages. used to talk to every one of us. Dieu parle à chacun de nous. I repeat, dream are messages that God passes through us to help ourselves, pour nous aider, to defend ourselves, pour nous défendre, our brothers and sisters or loved ones. Et nos et nos amis. Some of us, parmi nous, we dream today, we forgot about the dream. Et nous oublions. You ask me all those questions. Allez poser toutes ces questions. Why I forgot my dreams? Pourquoi j'oublie mes rêves? Am I talking to somebody? Yes, you are sir. talking to Rosa. God cannot talk to you because you are not a prophet. Or you are not a prophet. Directement. One on one, as I'm saying. Comme je le dis, as Prophet Jeremiah is hearing the word of God, comme le Dieu dit, every time, you cannot hear tu peux pas from God the way I am hearing. From God, but you can receive and hear from God through His Word, through dream, through dreams, because He loves you. He is the one that created you. In life, God talked to every man, every woman. Through dreams, in Par order rêve, to save them in their lives from vie, danger. To prend charge. Remember, Joseph, Joseph, Jesus, to Joseph as a baby in Israel. And, Israel. and the Et enemies came. Les ennemis sont venus. The king was about to kill. Le roi voulait tuer the only son that sent to save our lives. Pour sauver notre vie. But I don't know what really happened. The enemy escaped. Ce passé. And God Dieu, Dieu, did not talk to him one on one. La God la face, spoke to him parlé, through dreams. Par les rêves. And gave him instruction. Il a donné l'instruction. Any man, any woman that who had dreams, toute femme qui ont le rêve, you have to look for instruction. 
doit suivre les so that your dream pour que tes rêves may manifest, may manifest be cancelled. Et aussi conseillé. Every man that would dream dreams today, Tom qui rêve les rêves, like the case of Jesus Christ, comme le cas de Jésus, and they follow the instruction of God, et suit l'instruction de Dieu, and the dream, donc les rêves, surely come to pass, and the family saved. Et la famille sera sauvée. Our Father Jesus Christ was saved Le through dreams. Jésus a été sauvé par les rêves. So, Donc, any man or any pastor, any woman of God, Tom, or any man of God that says dream is nothing, Dieu, that man of God needs deliverance. Need what? Deliverance. De la deliverance. deliverance. Right on, sir. So, dream Donc, les rêves is the only way that God chemin. used to talk to you and I. Que Dieu parle à toi et First, moi. before vision, before avant la prophecy, vision, avant la prophecy, or revelation, ou bien la révélation. Many pastors today, beaucoup de pasteurs aujourd'hui, many pastors today, beaucoup de pasteurs aujourd'hui. They don't have this gift. Many men of God, if you go, they will interpret in a way that you will understand. But it's a special gift that God has given to special people. And it's very rare. The beginning of a dream, it just matters. The ending part of a dream of a man, it matters. It gives results the resultat to the whole dream that you dream about. Tous les rêves que tu as rêvé. Whatever thing that happened to a man must happen. You must see it through your dream before it happens. But we don't know the importance of dream. L'importance des rêves. Today, donc aujourd'hui, it is dream and interpretation. Et le jour de rêve et interprétation, Then, solution was, must be given to et you. la solution Amen. est chose. I repeat, today is dream and interpretation. L'interprétation After rêve, interpreting your dreams, then solution must be given to you. Yes. Yes. A prophet that prophesies to a person without solution prophète, is useless. Sans solution, c'est inutile. Let me tell you. Laissez-moi vous dire. When God visited Joseph, he told him what Il about to happen. Ce qui va se passer. He said, the king is about to kill little children because of Jesus. And he now said, the solution is you have to run away from this place. With a baby. Am I talking to somebody there? Yes, sir. Somebody quickly turn with me to the book of Joel 2. 28. Joel 2, 28. Joel 2, 28. Come to pass afterwards. And it shall come to pass that I will pour out my spirit upon all. I, the Lord, I will pour out my spirit. And your sons and your daughters shall prophesy. The daughters and sons of God will prophesy. Your old men shall dream dreams. The old men shall dream dreams. Dreams. The young men shall see visions. The young men, like little Jeremiah and uh, Chico Chie, can prophesy. God bless you. Go read that. Now, we have come. It's a brief meeting and it's powerful. Reunion, bref, et très puissant. A brief meeting. Une reunion brève. Some of the brief meeting. Très bref. And it's powerful. Et c'est très puissant. A man's dream can cover everybody's interpretation and solution. I will be with you people for dream and interpretation. Then I will pour out the blessings Et ensuite, upon je everybody. Les sur toute personne. Then the solution. So Et that solution, when you go, quand vous allez partir, when you come across to dreams that you like, you don't like, manière, then you know what to do. Et vous allez savoir quoi in order faire. to help yourself. Daughter, I'm about to teach you 
ce que je vais vous enseigner, as a teacher, comme un, as a prophet, comme un prophète, you will raise up, you have the same trip that you want me to interpret for you and give you the solution and other people to now benefit. Raise up your arms single-handedly. Okay, that woman. Your name, where you come from. My name is Linda Aguma from Benue State, Makodi. If yes. someone dreamed going to the village, seeing her dead relatives, what is the meaning, prophet? God bless you. Where you, do you come from? I come from Benue State, Makodi. Somebody had a dream about relatives. Is it dead or dead. alive? Dead ones. Yeah. The meaning of that dream that is the villagers while you are in another place. Uh, you are in where? Makodi town. Makodi town. Makodi is very far from your village. Makodi is a city on its own. Then the village what consigned you that in Makodi consigned dead people in the village. That dream means many, many things. In other words, She's talking about death. People that who have died. You have seen, she's seen, a man seen them. The dream means many, many interpretations and many questions. When a woman had a dream about dead relatives in the village, while she is in a township, city, what is the meaning? The meaning of that dream is number one. The person that who had that dream about dead people, number one, the person is always sick. It's always what? Sick. Dead people that you have seen in the dream. People that who have died have died. You have no any connection with dead people. The killing, the, the thing that killed those people, the person, or so also person in the family, that is now God is telling that person that the person should pray against untimely death in the family. And the person that who have had that dream is always sick, taking tablets, pills, taking tablets, something that there's a pain always coming around the person. Sense a sickness that always coming to the person. The person experiencing a sickness at which the person is not supposed to uh, experience. And that's, the person is treating that sickness. I want to ask you, madam, Who had that dream? I am the one. Okay, now. When you see those people, what kind of, how, you, how do you feel in your body around you? There is something that used to always come out of my hips here. Come where? So, out of out my hips. Something appears coming out from your body. Eh? Yes? Very Painful and no medicine. medicine just a fungal infection. infection which no medicine to the, cure it. Yes, prophet. And any time you had this dream, and miscarriage happen. And miscarriage happen. Miscarriage is an attack. It's mm -hmm. a sickness. So also the thing that always coming out from that place always what? Come out. Comes out. <laughs> you can see now. Am I talking to somebody right now? Yes, sir. What is the way out? What is the way out? Please, my prophet. Yes. You are going to now pray a prayer. Because it's a sickness in a way of attacking you. For you to be sick. And when the sickness comes, don't you take tablets? I do. So you, anytime you see that dream, you always take tablets. And an injection is very painful. Eh? With injection, With very you, painful injection. Very painful injection. It doesn't help me. It just help you. Mm. Uh, you see now. 
So um, you should take injection. I've told you that if anybody see relatives that died in the family have nothing to do with you. As an evil strategy to attack you for you to be sick or die like them. That's the meaning of that dream. And the person that will have that dream have to now do something in order to be that dream to be cut off. It is not good. What is the way out? Now, when she, sees, she saw that dream, something comes out from her body. Then she missed a period. And she began to take tablets. And the tablets that she had been taking cannot help her. How many times? All to 16 years out of married. No baby. Because of that problem, no baby in the marriage. Okay, because of you are seeing that thing, that thing every time. So now you are looking for baby and the baby is not yet coming. Yes, prophet. All right. What are you going to do? The way out, number one. Go. You may go to a deliverance pastor to deliver you. Hire pastor or prophet to deliver you or you can also do it by yourself to cancel it. How will you do it and cancel it? You're going to now address because they use that one as a weapon to pull, to scatter your marriage in order to scatter your marriage, in order to put you in pains. One, you will now address that villagers, the spirits, I will call it familiar spirits. They used to attack you. That familiar spirit that they used to attack you, what you're going to do, you're going to now address them. So whosoever and whatsoever that died in my family, they used to attack me from my village. Let those evil powers, the powers that are attacking me, let them die second time. Amen. Amen. Hear me well. Yes, prophet. Put your hands together for Jesus. What do I say? You said that all these evil people that died in my village that are appearing to me, let them die second time. Second, two times. Let them die again. Let them die again. Uh, yes, so that when you are praying that prayer, it is now, you are now sending the prayer, the armor to kneel the head of the nail. That is their wicked point. Yes, Am I talking to somebody? Thank you, sir. Thank you. When you, every time, When you know, you find yourself, before you knew, you, 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 you have taken in, before you miss your prayer, the dream comes. Yes, prophet. Eh? Yes, sir. That's where they used to get to you. Yes, sir. God bless you. There are many ways that they used to get uh, pregnant women and who are looking for babies. In every man that on earth, they use different talent. They are very talented. Very, very. They have knowledge. Very, very. So also we have, but the Bible says he has given us power to tramp down snakes and scorpions. So madam, from now on, that is a prayer that you're going to pray. Then you will see God is going to deliver you. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. And whosoever that worship me, you are dreaming about your relatives that they used to manipulate you from now on, from now forth. Let the power of Holy Spirit begin to destroy their evil plans. In the name of Jesus. Dream and interpretation today is going to touch and change your life in the name of Jesus Christ. Come here. In Jesus' name. You're free. Together for Jesus. Tell Senior Prophet Jeremiah almost to your dreams today. And God is going to give you an interpretation that will give you peace through him. My name is Apostle K. Jesus from Delta State. If somebody, somebody swimming in the dream. Swimming in the water. Yeah. Somebody will say, let's cross to the other side and meet those people there. You will see white people the other side then 
I will be the first person to swim and cross and meet them. At times, I see people fishing. Swimming in a dream, in other words, one, you as a minister of God, you will go and minister in abroad. That is the meaning of that one. Who are you, sir? I'm a prophet. Are you planning to go to abroad? Through your ministry? People are calling me to come, I said, until God tell me to go. And I've been praying for you to direct me. I don't want to go on my own. You will go when the time comes. God is telling you, not only me go tell you something. God is telling you that you must go to abroad. Then the general swimming in the dream. Some people, they find themselves swimming in the village. Remember, that place that you are swimming, there are powers in that place that you find yourself. You know the place and you are not there. You bath in that place. Or your mother bath you there. You are young. The, the demons in that place have now a covenant with you. That's why in order to cause setback, cause and delay, one thing or the other, disappointments. That's why you are seeing yourself in that place when you are a baby. But you know the place. Check yourself. You were swimming in that place. The powers in that place, the time you bath there, they have, have a covenant with you in order to not attack your spirit. They are also monitoring you. So what will make you to come out from that attack? It's you're going to now address that place. You call the name of the place that from now on, and those who are now experiencing that is, they, God has gift or blessing for them to move forward. But any time, when the time good things come, they, they just receive little. Somebody say little. Little. Small. They are not receiving in full. So the stream, you have to address that place. Call the name of the place. I, I detach myself. I am not this one. Let the blood of Jesus take over that place and seal that power. Before you know that thing, you will not find yourself again. Or a village that you were always finding yourself. That where you're not supposed to be. A village, oh, you were young before. You know that you were young. And you're finding yourself in a village. Your destiny been attached to that village. You have to cut yourself away from fire die fire die what are you saying fire die have you addressed that village in your prayer life you have to address that place that you are finding yourself it brings answer faster than fire die are you hearing me the bible says yeah pray you ask me nothing you ask me nothing nothing mm. I the lord I have given you I told you to ask ask me anything but you ask me nothing. And you find yourself in a village. They said, prosperity, prosperity. You have to stop the strong man. Am I talking to somebody? Yes, sir. Dream and interpretation. And God bless you. Tell Senior Prophet Jeremiah almost for your dreams today. And God is going to give you an interpretation that will give you peace through him. That woman, that woman, yes. My name is Patricia Jaram from Ori here. Yes, go ahead. If someone had a dream. Yes. And he saw a, a giant um, snake with the head of a lion. And as he was about to kill the lion, and the, together with the snake, the body of the snake, a, a man, a white a man on a white garment appeared. And he said the person should go to the mountain of grace. That on top of the stone, there is a sledge armor. That he should use the armor and use it to hammer the the head of the lion that has the body of the snake. Why the person was about to hammer it, a voice came that you cannot hammer it, that you don't have the right, except your father comes in. And the father now came in and he held the hand, the put father, his hand on top the, the of The father of the person. The father of the person, yes, okay, sir. Okay, yeah. And he now hold the head, hand of his father and he hammer it to death. After he finished hammering it, then they, they asked him, the person said they should cut it to pieces. And they cut it to pieces and threw it away. After then, the person saw herself in his village, in the middle of his village. And he saw this whole 2020 naira, that paper type, was draining from the sky. And the same man was telling him to pack. What is the meaning, prophet? God bless you. I go straight to the point. Somebody had a dream. And this dream is about a giant snake. And this giant snake has just appeared to attack the person. Yes, sir. With the head of a lion. With the head of a lion. Yes, sir. The head is, the head is lion. lion. The back is snake. Yes, sir. So, 
and somebody appeared with the white garment. Yes, sir. And said, go to the mountain of solution. Which mountain one? Of grace, mountain, mercy and grace. mountain of mercy and grace. And uh, begin to now take uh, uh, hammer. hammer. Yes, sir. And hammer it. Yes. And the person just wanted to now hammer it. A voice came. Yes, sir. And the voice said what? You don't have the right to hammer it except your father comes. Then you find the person find yourself, yourself or herself in the village. The father not came. The father came. Okay. Yes. Uh -huh. And they asked him to hold the hammer. Uh -huh. Then the person should put his hand on top of him. Uh -huh. And they hammer the, 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 snake the snake and the lion to death. The lion to death. And the lion died. He died and he cut it to pieces. And he cut it to pieces. Yes, and what happened next? After then, the person see herself in his village, in the middle of a village. The middle and of saw this old 20 naira paper type uh -huh. raining from the sky. Okay. And they asked her to pack. And asked her to what? To pack them. To pack them. To pack what then? To pack the 2029. Okay. Uh, what's her name? Patricia Jara. Patricia, Patricia. Your dream or the person that who had this dream means you are the one that who are now talking to me. The dream goes like this. Your father, this is an attack that goes to your father. This is, is an idol they worship in the family. It's true. Who worship that idol? My grandfather. Okay. That's <laughs> that, that idol that your grandfather worship, it affected your father. Your father did not complete a building. You know building? Yes, sir. There is a building. Yes, sir. Your father couldn't complete it. It's, it's true, sir. That's the half. Half of a lion, half of a snake. Then you come back again. Then you, the thing affected your father as a, as a, as a, as a, as a man. Then he give birth to you. Not only you yes, that he has given birth. Yes, this sir. thing has now affected other people. Now, the thing come to you as a person. Now, you as a person, the thing now come to you. The Lord is now telling you, the same suffer, your father suffered. You also now passing through that challenges. Delay is there. Yes, sir. Failure is there. Yes, sir. What is happening in your marriage? Failure, divorce. You are you dis divorced from your marriage. Yes, sir. That is what is happening now. That is not all. Now, now, God is telling you that where you're going to now get the solution, it is through mountains. The mountain of favor or mountain of power or mountain of mercy. Anywhere you go, you will now going to now. This, the man that will appear to you is it's an angel that because of your prayers, you have been crying for this attack. That you are passing through for a long time. Yes, God is now telling you that you, you want to know, and you are asking yourself, you want to know about the cause of this delay, cause of this failure. Yes. And now the failure, them, now the delay and the failure. Now God has now shown you as a prophetess. Now listen, prophetess, in other words, I've told you every man here, God talked to us through dream. Early, early age, remember that one. So right now. What God is now telling her that through her prayers in the mountains, she can overcome. But the armor that your father have now taken, uh, uh, that you wanted to use to hammer it, that your father should appear before this thing, before you hammer it. Because the thing have affected your father through your father that you experience or you are facing that challenge. Then you now hammer it. Your father hammer it. You put sand. Eh? Yes, and through sand, you, you, you overcome it. Then, you now put sand and you kill it and you cut it into. That is called victory. You are overcoming the powers and principalities right through mountains. Do you go to the mountains? I've been there for three months now, sir. Three months. And before I had this dream. Before you I'm had this dream. Okay. Now, you are going to the mountains and the God is showing you that where you are going to, the mountain, the mountain of what? 
of mercy and grace. Okay, that where you are. So that's what God said. Where you have come to is going to cut off, cut off the problem. Cut off what? Amen. The problem. Then, then you find yourself after cutting off the snake. Then you find yourself in the village. Middle of my village. Middle of your what? Village. Your village. And you now find what's called 2020. The paper type. Paper. Old paper the old. Yeah. Yes. There is a business that you were doing before. Yes, sir. And the business collapsed. Yes, sir. Oh, you're not. You're not. You're not. <laughs> God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. It's a gift on its own. It's a gift. Very rare. When you look at the Bible, very rare. Very rare. Very, very rare. Now, what kind of business you do before? And the business you were doing before, the business were giving you petty, petty money. Money was not coming in. And the business lost at last. Yes, sir. What kind of business were you doing before? Oh, selling cosmetics. And, and what happened to the business? And it collapsed. All of them, all the shops. I will say I cannot go back to market. I will say I will put in money I cannot buy like that. That's all. Can I say something somebody? Central of the village. I go to central of the village. What is central of the village? Your father gave birth to you. And there are other people. But you are like in between. Center. Yes, sir. How many people it, your father gave birth? Four then. I'm twins in between. Four years, four years. Then I'm the twins. Me and my brother are twins in between. The middle. The middle. Yes, sir. We are talking about things of dream and interpretation. <laughs> the way must come out today. Amen. The answer, solution, and whosoever that, whosoever that having dream like this, whatever snake, whatever old ancient things that are attacking you because you are watching Messy TV, these snakes and dreams and they attacking you, they are attacking you for long, but from now on, it is over. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Madam, number one, you have overcome. Amen. The dream. But come outside. Let me just touch you so that things will move well with you. God bless you. Jam your hands together for Jesus. Amen. So sister, it is done. What happened to your father? What's the house? What happened to the house? He, he built the house. Yes, sir. What happened to the house? Completed. That is talking about the lion. <laughs> lion and snake. After I touch you, you pray this prayer. Say, whosoever. Somebody pray this. Say, whosoever. whosoever. And whatsoever. Assigned to attack me, assigned to suffer me in my family, and whosoever, and whatsoever, and whatsoever that attack my father, that attack my father, that attack my, that attack my mother, attack my mother, that suffer my father, that suffer my father, and my mother, and my mother, now assigned to suffer me, now assigned to suffer me, wherever they are. Wherever they have, let them suffer. Let them suffer. In the name of Jesus, pray. Let them suffer. Let them suffer. In the name of Jesus, pray. Whatever power that has shine to stop me, to suffer me, let them suffer. Let them suffer. In Kalataba, in Kolosha, Paiposate, let them suffer. Let them suffer. Let them suffer. In the name of Jesus. Let them suffer in Jesus' name. Let them suffer, suffer, suffer in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, your enemies must suffer. Amen.
In Jesus' name, every attack go back to sender. Amen. In Jesus' name, whosoever that fighting you will lose their battle. Amen. And you will make it in Jesus' name. Amen. Every negative dream that they used to attack you is canceled today. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Put your hands together for Jesus. Now, Madam, breakthrough has come. You, you have already overcome. Arrivée. You have overcome the battle through the mountains. The mountain you have gone to have now made you to overcome the battle. May God bless you all. Jesus, put your hands together for Jesus. Tell Senior Prophet Jeremiah almost to your dreams today, and God is going to give you an interpretation that will give you peace through Him. My name, the boy is one day. Go straight to your. Your point. The boy is Sunday. So, if somebody dream, is he now on top of bonnet of motto? Huh? So, on top of bonnet or motto? Bonnet, bonnet. Yes, bonnet. So, they come and carry in the night, carry, carry it up and drop it on top of the motto. They break. Come here, come again, come again. Yeah. If somebody dream about this is called bonnet, at the front of a car. Yes, sir. Sitting there. Yeah. Huh? Yes, sir. Uh -huh. What happened to the person? So, so, somebody come and carry in the dream. Carry it up. Somebody carry what, what up? Carry the, the person up. Okay, somebody carry the person up. Up. And drop it on top of the bonnet again. They break. They start feeling pain. Carry the person from the bonnet up. Up. And he drop it on top of the bonnet again. Like a, take it to just knock uh, around or how? He just drop it. He just drop it. Yes, sir. And they break. The person waste. Start to repair the person. Mm, don't be waste matter. You have to... Uh, you have to ask me a question, not answer. A bonnet. It's a simple something. Look at, look at, look. Sure. Bonnet is the front of a car. Yes, sir. Sure. See. A cover of an engine. Somebody just come from nowhere. Do you know the person? No, I don't know the person. Just carry you from that bonnet. You were sitting there and now the person just carry you up and put you down again. Yes, sir. And you wake up. Yes, sir. Your waist began to pain you. Yes, sir. What is the meaning? What is the meaning, sir? Brother... The meaning of that dream. God is telling you as a brother. Not only that day. You have a waist pain. Some time ago. Am I talking to you? Yes sir. You have a what? I have my waist is paining me sir. Yes, sometime before that day. Yes sir. Yes, you were experiencing waist pain time yes. to time. Yes sir. God is telling you about God is telling you about this waste. Why your waste is paining you? Why? Because there are powers that behind this case. And the, the waste pain is not ordinary. Then I come to the bonnet. There was a time this waste pain you complain about when you enter into a car. This waist pain, you complain about it. Yes, sir. And also, this waist pain, the bonnet is where it opens. Yes, sir. What bonnet do? 
bonnet is open and closed. Eh? Yes, your, your waist, look at me. It's referred to your waist. Yes, sir. Your dream is very, very uh, 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 talented and at the same time, it's an attack that they have sent attack to your waist. Not only that, that waist been paining you, not that day that you saw the deceit, that waist been paining you before that very day. God is now telling you that the people, there are people that are behind that waist pain. How long the waist started paining you? It don't reach three years now. It don't reach three years. Yes, sir. Before you, when you, when you saw, when you, when you find, when you saw that dream, almost three weeks. Three weeks. Yes, sir. Look at the time now. Three years, the thing started. God is telling you that there are people that after this you always pain. It is not ordinary. Yes, sir. So you have to now pray about it. Am I talking to somebody? Yes, sir. Number two, the waist pain that wear uh, the, the bonnet that who have carried you and who have dropped you there is the attackers. Then, the, 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 where you wear and the waist pain, how this waist will go. Pain will go. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. How the waist go take go for me is you will help me, sir. <laughs> it's not yet ended. The waist pain, it means another thing about the bonnet. I want to talk about the bonnet again. The bonnet, number one, as I told you, referring to the waist. You can open bonnet and open and close. Abi? Yes, that's the spiritual waist. Okay, there is engine there. There is machine here that controlling the hair. So that's how it is. Then, what uh, about the this thing? Then it's also that the same thing is also referring you, referring you to a to a chair. Chair, you know chair? Yes, sir. Chair, you know chair? Yes, sir. There is a chair you used to sit. The chair is not balanced. Yes, sir. Where that chair is? That is my working place, sir. Then, then you come again. <laughs> this man. Then you come again. In your bed. The bed that you sleep. The bed that you sleep. The same bonnet too. The bed that you sleep, the foam, the center of the foam is going down. Yes, sir. One. I want to give you the solution now. Huh? Yes, sir. The solution is you will not eat too much rice. Too much what? Too much rice. Then you will not take cold water. Yes, sir. You like cold water. You know cold water? Yes, sir. The one that in the fridge, Abby? Yes, sir. So you have to now avoid it. Yeah. Then rice. Yes, sir. Why you eat like right last? I eat rice every day. <laughs> oh, you are not, 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 you are not. I don't sir. So, you will stop now. From now, just give yourself. So, brother, those are the things you come out. Let me just deliver you. Then, you have to, your foam, your chair. You hear me? Yes, your, sir. Yeah, your chair. Your chair, you have to now change. One, one with the other. Your position of sitting. Eh? You have yes, to, sir. Yeah, you have to correct it now. Thank you, sir. Because many things that we ignorantly, we cause it. We cause it. When the devil attacked, then we now support, we supported the devil to increase the sickness. Somebody say hallelujah. Hallelujah. In the crowd, you just came out. In the crowd, they were said, you had a dream. In the dream, you in the crowd. Huh? Yes, sir. 
and you just pass one side. Yes, sir. And you just you came out. Yes, sir. And I just do you like this. Yes, sir. And two eggs. Yes, sir. Just came out. Yes, sir. And the two eggs that just came out. Then I now just. And I throw it for you. You you, you, bring, you brought them. Yes, sir. You brought them to me. Yes, sir. And I just carry them. Uh, and I just. To me again. Give you back. Yes, and I'm the grand day. And you don't drink them. Are you buried them? Buried them there. Is it not crowd here? It's crowd here. Is it on one side you pass come? Yes, sir. Were you thinking that today you would be like this before? No, sir. And so the, the sickness there is attacked. It's like an egg. So I want to now remove it. Yes. Then you will bury it here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Power. My father. <laughs> you want to bury them here, 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 here. Yeah. Dream and interpretation. The father of dream and interpretation is here. Joseph cannot come back and interpret again. But God is going to give his grace. You pour upon the children to interpret. If you want your dream and interpretation, you'll get the answer solution. Call for Mercy City. You come to Mercy City Delta State for it. I, Prophet Jeremiah Motosufu, I will interpret it to you. Dream God should for, through us for us to get our answer, what to do and what not to do in order to get have the solution instantly. But people doesn't know. We don't know. We don't know the way out. But today, God has sent me to introduce dream and interpret for you to come out from that attack. May God bless you as you come in Jesus' name. Amen. Now, listen. The egg. Some of the egg. egg. Those eggs, one for sickness. When you go to egg, one for sickness. Then the other one is for promotion. Your promotion has been attacked before. Yes, then sir. the other one is for sickness. Yes, right sir. now, as you have come out today, the sickness also will go. The yes, way sir. they promoted you, so also your sickness will be buried there. Amen. Now, the sickness, if you come like this, if I don't interpret this dream before, because of your coming, this sickness will also go. Amen. Are you Thank hearing me? Thank you, sir. So already your problem has been buried. Yes, sir. That is your number one. The number one problem you are facing is your, your, your promotion. Number two is your waist pain. Am I talking to you? Yes, sir. So open Thank it. You. Open it. Egg. Somebody say egg. Egg. This thing, how it look like? Yoke. Yoke of what? Egg. Uh -huh. Spiritual egg. What about bury it here? Bury it. <laughs> My father. When I do like this, what happened to him? Uh, what, uh, well, you just watch out. You will see what's going to happen. Power! Put your hands together for Jesus. It is done. Somebody stand up and pray this prayer. Say, every attack. Every attack. From my enemies. From my enemies. In unknown people. Known people in my family, in my family assigned to attack me, assigned to pull me down. From now, from now on, let your evil attack backfire. In the name of Jesus, backfire. In the name of Jesus, backfire. 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 Backfire, backfire, backfire. Back. In the name of Jesus, backfire, backfire, back. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Tell Senior Prophet Jeremiah or most of your dreams today. And God is going to give you an interpretation that will give you peace through him. All right. Hey, you. Yes, this man. Yes. Uh, my name is Pastor Mondo Basin. I'm from Cotonou. Sir, if one has a dream. Yeah. In a vision, he saw himself dead. And he was put in a gasket. And they put him inside the gasket. Takes him to burial ground. As he went to the burial ground, they laid the gasket in the grave to cover the gasket. Thunder 
from above, struck that box, and a hand from above laid upon him. Hairs, the beards of the man, laid upon his chest. Then he could not be able to look upon that man. But a voice said to him, my son, stand up. You will not die. You must live to serve me. And he, he stand up. And he went again in a place of vision as he was praying. The heaven opened. There was a voice from the moon that called him. He said, my son, you accomplish what I send you for. You are calling for the purpose and not for our service. And he looks up. He saw a golden Bible passing through. And the voice said, my friend, straight your hand. He straight up his hand and the Bible was given to him. Including sword. And he was told, go ahead and execute a judgment. Sir, unexpectedly, he found himself in a battle where battalions in of the army, dream, all this in the, in the, in, in, Yes, in the dream, sir. He saw himself, battalions covered him. Then, from nowhere, a machine gun was given to him. He started fighting the battle. As he was fighting the battle, he kills many, but he got weak. From nowhere, someone picked up his, his pistol and shot him in the ear. When he woke up physically, he saw a blood gushing out from his ears and his prayed. The next thing that the is... Phys the physical. Okay, stop. In the physical, he saw the, he saw the okay. blood. It's okay. All right, sir. When you wake up, blood came out from you. Yes, sir. Physically. Yes, sir. Yet people are so wicked. This is a dream. Dream about yourself. This is dead. I will summarize it because it's a long story. This is dead. And you died. Carrying you to the graveyard. The sir. graveyard where it's called cemetery. And they even bury you there. They buried you and a voice came. Come up. Yes, sir. And a thunder also struck. Yes, sir. And you came up. Yes, sir. When you came out, and they said, for nowhere, for no reason, for no how, machine gun just enter your hand. Then cutlass enter your hand. You begin to kill many. After killing many, a pistol gone from your, your body, Abby. Yes, sir. The, somebody just took the gun. And begin to the, fire the you, head. Your, your, your ear, have you? Yes, sir. And you wake up. Blood were coming out physically. Physically, sir. A Bible was also given to you. Yes, sir. With sword. With what? Sword. 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 When they gave you the Bible. Sir? When they gave you the Bible. In the camp, in the in camp the, where he was praying. Inside the dream, too. In the dream, what? Where they give you? The Bible, the Holy Bible. The Bible was given to you before you died, or, or when you wake up before they're giving you the Bible. No, after I, I wake up, the Bible was given to me. <laughs> and that way I want to do so. When you wake up from the, when they come out from the grave, yes, before the Bible was what? Given to me with sword. All right, with sword. Brother, it's a battle. God sent you. Do the work of God as a pastor, as a man of God. But attacks from nowhere, different places. Something happened. When you were doing this, the, is the work of God and evangelizing, something happened to you. You would have been a dead person by now. Nearly, nearly, physically, I could have been a dead person. Nearly, you would have been a dead person. By, by now, your story would have come. Yes, sir. Story, just something just happened to you as a person. What happened is, is this. 
Because they are planted in order to bury you, kill you physically so that you, your, your disturbance of, to the kingdom of God, uh, to their evil kingdom is stopped. So, something happened. It's like an accident. You know accident? Yes, sir. This it's is, happened physical, sir. Yeah, this it's is happened physical, sir. This is accident. It's happened physical. It happened physically. Physical. In order for you, you were even gone before. Yes, sir. The accident would have taken your life before. Yes, sir. But something just happened. Yes, sir. When in the, in the process of, you know, you don't know what happened. The accident, but in like a, like a, like a, like a, when you were, you were like a coma, coma, you know coma? Yes, sir. You were in a coma. And That's happened to uh, 1998, sir. 1998. As soon we were coming, I was traveling with this Vito Car for the late Ezek of oh, Somebody yeah. put your hands together for Jesus. The father of dream and interpretation. Go ahead, my father. <laughs> Go ahead. Oh, you are not, you are not, you are not, you are just like that. Go oh. deeper, Papa. So, this man would have been in the grave by now. That is true, sir. We have done the skeleton by now. Since 1998, I've been, nobody could have remembered me now. And that's the step I said. Because of your, 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 you were preaching. Listen, God, because of the gift of God is in you. God is now telling that he is with you. They cannot do you anything. But your prayers, people have complained about your prayers. That you should stop praying. Because of these prayers, many things are happening in your family now. Yes, sir. People just neglect you. People just hate you for no reason. Yes, sir. This is my junior brother. Maybe they junior. Your junior brother. Younger brother. Your younger brother? Yes, sir. Okay. Now, because of this, now God has given you, after the, this, after the attack, God has given you what is called, he increased your grace more than before. Amen. Yes, sir. And something happened. Something happened, sir. Something happened again. Yes, sir. They said when he was now, after giving him the distance, he was killing and he was killing. He was also doing the work of God on the process. The ministry, his own ministry, his own worker, your own worker, just carries something, accuse you. That is true, sir. That Accurate. Is, that's the reason I'm here, sir. The king of Ayakati kings Go ahead, Father. You are, you are, old, sir. You are a man of extraordinary man. Hey. Uh, uh, sir, wait, wait, wait. wait. Huh? Sir, you are the only man among men. An extraordinary man. On February, sir, uh -huh. I was here for the, the last program. I have a church I went to plant at Aba, at 140 Portacot Road. After the program, I went to my started the plantation. Then I bought some, it's my dear brother that bought those uh, spiritual uh, instruments for me. Reaching to the church, I started praying. The owner of the church said I should not apply anything that I brought here. So as I was praying, I said, okay, I will do as you said. I was praying for the kids. Then one woman from nowhere ran to me, said, Pastor Pastor, I said, yes. He said, there's a brother who came from Mabuja that is there in the Soka that look at the picture. I said, What's happened? As, I want, as, as she wants to talk, I say, go, give me the picture. She gave me the picture. Then I kneel down at the altar, and I raise up the picture. I say, God, the prophet Jeremiah Omoto Fufe, who have been doing something extraordinary in the life of people. I know that I'm not qualified. I know that my hands are being stained with evil. But because of the patience, because of whatever I have been doing in the land of Basic City, let me hear from you. As I sleep, there was a revelation. God showed me what was happening in the family. That the father was a native doctor from Nisoka that married about 50 something wives. So I saw this man in the grave. So I was praying in the grave. I said, okay, my son, come out. I brought him out. Then physically, the, the sister ran to me. What's happened? I said, okay, he now can go. But as he's going, he will see what the God of Prophet Jeremiah, Omoto Fefe, is about to do. Then as he was going, that he don't want me anymore by using that instrument. Who? The owner of the church. The as owner of his, As you leave his the church. This is the church. A brother. A brother. Some say brother. 
the brother. The Bible says the people that who are in the church, we are all brothers and sisters. So church member, the church person that attack you. That's not all attack. Which ear? Which ear? Which ear they shot? Left. Which, left. Yes, sir. Oh, left stand for your wife. Where's your wife? Sir, I've been divorced since, 19, since 1995. <laughs> accurate! Accurate! The king of dream and interpretation. Oh, you are 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 Senior, senior, senior prophet. Professor. Somebody shout. <laughs> it's a grace on its own. Now, sir, that's, you were fighting this battle, you were making it before, but suddenly the enemies came and they now begin to accuse you as a brother or sister. Now they accuse you in order to now have a problem with you. Are you hearing me? You are right, sir. Uh-huh. So that's where they bring, it, bring it out the gun from you. You were getting them before. Small time they also get, got to you. Brother, are you brother to him? The brother? Yes, sir. Who is it to you? It's my senior brother, sir. Okay. My well, name is Mr. Paul Obasi. Okay. Your, 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 your elder brother is now uh, facing a problem. But right now, the Bible says, let uh, uh, iron sharpen it iron. So I am going to deliver you. Your own is just need iron grace. Are you enemy? Yes. So that let the grace in you begin to now. I want to now give you iron grace. Are you enemy? Yes. The mission gone that he was shooting the people. The mission gone stand for. The mission gone stand for the oil and the rest that you are about to now apply to, to destroy the evil plants. But the enemies came. They said, no way. Why you do this? That's where the first the, the attack come. But you have, from now, you have overcome. Amen. Your grace, higher you will go. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. Name. Power. Truth and interpretation. Go on, sir. Go ahead. Dream and interpretation. Stand up and pray this prayer. Say, my father, my father, Jehovah, Jehovah, Jesus, Jesus. any evil dream that I dream about myself, people dream about me from now. Be counsel in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Be counsel now in the name of Jesus. Be counsel now in Palapapa. Eko kakate li pro shampaiba be kasona be kasona in the name of Jesus I kaso I kaso be kasona be kasona in the name of Jesus in Jesus name we are praying Amen All right you may be seated We are still on dream and interpretation Viewers all over the world, wherever you are watching Mr. TV, I am Prophet John Mambo I am here to now inform every one of you that every man dreams dreams. Uh, remember, Jesus Joseph was the one that we interpret dreams in the Bible, and God gave him that grace. It is grace. It is grace. Dream. Any man that who had a dream, there is solution. There is solution. God is talking to you direct. You don't need a prophet. You are a prophet on your own. You are a prophetess on your own. You don't need a prophet. God been prophesying to you, but you don't understand. Am I talking to somebody? Yes, sir. As far as uh, the, the, uh, uh, you, you, you don't understand, you have to run to who know and who understand. Dream and interpretation. That was why the king now said, who can interpret this dream? The fat ones are cows, and these are small cows. And the small ones ate up the fat ones. What is the meaning? Am I talking to somebody? Yes, sir. 